Hi, yeah, this is uh, just an explanation on how to upgrade um, uh, your iMac 27 inch or 21 and a half inch 2011 model or later. Um, as most of you might know, if you're trying to upgrade one of these iMacs now, the hard drives, uh, uh, you've got to have a compatible hard drive. So uh, what we've done here is we've upgraded uh, the hard drive that comes with the Mac. Uh, we've taken this one out. Um, there's loads of videos on YouTube to explain how to do this. So this is the official um, one terabyte drive that came with the Mac. Uh, it's a Seagate, so what we've done is we've installed a two terabyte hard drive, and you can see here capacity there, two terabyte. Um, and that's essentially doubling the speed, and obviously it's a lot cheaper to go for uh, off a shelf version instead of Apple's own. The unfortunate thing is the temperature control is a firmware based uh, hard drive. If it's, the firmware is based on the hard drive and it's Apple's own. So uh, what we've used is this SSD fan control, which is a free app. Uh, there are paid for versions out there, but we find this works fine. I'll just go into Launchpad and you'll see it as a, as a program that you can... Maybe not, not Launchpad. Uh, let's just go into Apps, Applications. So you will see... SSD, fan control there, and I can launch that. So that's the app. It's very simple. What we do is we just click on Smart. If I put it to Auto, the f what happens is the fans start going, uh, the temperature starts showing that it's going up when it's not, and I can just about hear now the fans coming on. So I'm going to put that back to Smart so it's nice and quiet. Um, we found that the the temperatures are a lot. Uh, the temperature is fine, but the whole thing's a lot quieter. You can just hide that program. It it doesn't run. It doesn't show. If I go into uh, force quit, you, it won't show that it's running. Okay, so it's not showing anything's running. So it's a really good app. It's completely free. I'll show the link as well in the information. So if you want that, and that's the easiest way. Uh, to upgrade your hard drive. Now there are reports you can't upgrade the hard drive unless you use the same brand. That's what I suggest. I haven't tried that myself. All we've done is gone Seagate to Seagate. Uh, so if you've got a Western Digital Drive, my suggestion would be to go for a Western Digital Drive. Uh, if you've got any questions, just ask us. Okay, take care. Bye.